Assalamu alaikum wa barakatuh. Good morning. Today we will start to listen. It speaks about all about schools. The title of the sermon is All About Schools. In this part, as we know, we will start with vocabulary and the situations. Let's start with the new camp today and we have to concentrate and be with me please. Repeat after me if you want and put every word in a sentence and keep them by heart. The first word is indoor cold. Indoor cold. Cold here has one meaning. It has two meanings, but here has a meaning of a playground or a place where you play. Indoor means inside a closed place. Outdoor means outside a closed place. If I have two 
contrasting information. They mean the opposite to each other. For example, he's tall, he can't play tennis, he can't play basketball. The ordinary thing that if you are tall, if you are tall, you can play basketball, but he can. So we use, however, although or but as we know. But how do we use however and how do we use although? Although comes at the beginning of two sentences. At the beginning of two sentences, which are separated by a comma. For example, although he was ill, he went to school. Although he was ill, he went to school. But how to use however? It starts with a capital letter. So we have to put it in between the two sentences. He was ill. However, comma, however, comma, he went to school. Another way, he was ill for a stop, he, however, comma, he went to school. So we can use two commas before however in the middle or a full stop and a comma. Let's look at this situation. The first situation, answer what would you say in this situation. The first one, you tell your, uh, your mother that you are good at English, but, but take okay, care, but, you like French, so I answer, although I'm good at English, comma, I like French, or I'm good at English, however, I like French, or I like French, however, I'm good at English. We start with this sentence with however. The next one you are asking, so you have to answer, which hobby you practice before for? You, so you will say, I practice Volleyball before football. Or, although I like football, I practice tennis. I think you're right. How do we think you're right? It's sunny today, but it's not very hot. Use, however, I say it's not hot. Follow stop or comma. However, Comma, it's sunny today. Use although, although it's sunny the same and start with it in the beginning. Although it's sunny. Today it's not a comma, it's not a take care of this. Here we change it between the sentences with however and although. We didn't put although just here and put the sentence. The sentence that comes after however is the same sentence that comes after although. Okay? Is everything clear? Thank you for listening and goodbye.